side. This is First Coast News at 6. We begin tonight with a First Coast News exclusive. Placing a loved one in assisted living is in no way an easy decision, in part because you hear about so many who mistreat or neglect patients. One Jacksonville woman says that was the case for their father after they moved him to a new facility. And now she plans to file suit. David, jo David Jones is joining us live tonight, getting answers, David. She filed a notice of intent on Tuesday, claiming malpractice against staff and administrators here at Heartland of Orange Park. Now that begins a 75 day waiting period before a lawsuit can be filed. And now she's speaking to us exclusively, detailing allegations of what she says happened to her father. A former boilermaker on Navy ships, 86 year old Frank Wright has always been a devoted family man. He doesn't do much talking, but he does talk and he calls me baby girl, you know. Vivian Wright has been a caretaker for her father since his stroke in 2013. After a second stroke, Frank Wright was admitted to a nursing home in Riverside before being transferred to Heartland of Orange Park in September. His daughter says the family's problems with Heartland started when they had their first meeting with staff. And then the head nurse, she started talking about hospice, and we were like, a jaw drop. Never heard that word. We, we understand that's coming. You know, you can't, it's the inevitable, but for you to hear the first time in a meeting, it did something to us mentally. It was like a downgrade. Over the next months, the family's concern would grow. Discouraging, frustrating, giving up. That's all I can think of. In a notice of intent to file a lawsuit, Vivian Wright says suggestions for continuing care with her father's physicians were ignored. She alleges staff at Heartland did not provide care for two wounds on her father, one of which she says got infected and started to stink. Wright claims staff placed coffee grounds under her father's bed to hide the smell. They didn't feel... They thought it was just normal, I guess, to put coffee ground on them. Like, they have done it before, but I don't know. But it just seemed normal to them to put coffee ground underneath the bed. Wright says she will move her father out of the facility after the lawsuit is on record. We did some digging and found two complaints in the past three years at Heartland that resulted in a citation. I do also want to read you part of a statement that was sent to us from Heartland's corporate offices. They wrote in part, the emotional and physical well-being of our residents is our primary concern. We take pride in our long-standing history of delivering quality care to the residents of this community. They declined to go further into details, citing patient privacy. We're live in Orange Park this evening. David Jones, First Coast News, on your side.